Joining me now is Geordie Tixier. Now, we've just had the exciting news that, Geordie, you've just signed a two-year contract with Monster Energy Kawasaki Racing Team. Step up from MX2 for MXGP. Tell us a little bit about that, how that came about. I mean, uh, like I said already many times, uh, already last year, uh, Kawasaki and Monster were really good with me. Uh, when KTM kicked me out, like, they were really good with me, and I signed for, for my last year in MX2 with, uh, with Kawasaki already. But uh, for the next few years, uh, I signed with uh, Kawasaki Factory Team KRT. So for myself, it uh, means uh, pretty much. I mean, uh, riding for the factory team with factory bike, with really good people around, it's always really good. So uh, really excited for the next few years, and uh, hopefully we can, uh, we can have some good results together and, uh, yeah, just keep going. And of course, staying with Monster Energy as well, that's always a good thing for you. As yeah, sure. It was also one of my goals. Uh, you know, I feel really good with the Kawasaki bike and I want to stay with that bike. So uh, that's why I decided to, to sign with those team, with that team. And uh, they were also really angry. So uh, I'm really happy to sign with those guys. Like I say, uh, Thierry were really good with me. Uh, Francois also, uh, Skip, Steve Guthrich. Uh, I mean, all the monster guys was really good with me. So uh, really happy to, to keep working with them. And uh, hopefully some good results together again in MX1 uh, with the big boys. Yeah. And in turn, you say with the big boys. Do you feel ready to make that leap from MX2 to MXGP? Are you mentally ready for it and prepared for 2016? Yeah, for the moment, I'm not ready, actually, you know. <laughs> I'm still riding MX2, so I just keep focused until the end of the season. But uh, after one winter, I think, yeah, I'm going to be ready and more fit. So uh, I'm really excited, you know, to know where I'm going to ride with those big boys. But uh, when I see Roma Fer, what he's doing now, and when he rode MX2, we fight together. So why not making the same result as him? Uh, I mean, uh, every rider is different, so you never know. But I'm just going to give my best ride in front. and. Uh, with a good bike, everything is possible, so we will see. Absolutely, and of course, it's a two-year contract. Is the approach at this stage, first year, maybe just to sort of get used to the bike, get used to the team, MXGP class, and then for the second year, just really go for it. Who knows what's possible? That was one of our goals. That's why we signed for two years. Uh, we just want to work together for a long time. So we decided to sign two years. I mean, the first year, just try to, to improve them the most as I can and uh, try to be the closest at the top five, I think. Uh, we will see and uh, for the year after just try to grow up and do a little bit better. <laughs> so uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, that's our plan, just learn the first year and then the second year just try to improve the most I can. Jordi, exciting times. Best of luck with the team, best of luck with 2016 and of course, the rest of this year. Thank you very much. I'm also excited. Thank you.